want to understand more about Iranian culture, don't just watch the news or Google Iran. Watch an Iranian film, movies made by Iranians for Iranians, providing entertainment, teaching history, and communicating values. Could there be a better way to explore a culture? The contemporary Iranian film industry is multifaceted. Common themes include the importance of family, ethics, and the clash of a traditional culture against a very modern perspective. However, a defining aspect of the Iranian film industry is censorship. For example, Babak Payami spent years making Silence Between Two Thoughts before it was confiscated by the police. The story concerns an executioner who decides that maybe it isn't the best idea to blindly follow the rules and regulations of others. This could be interpreted as opposing the Iranian government or the Islamic faith. Therefore, it is deemed unacceptable. Films are not allowed to portray a woman without her traditional garments and they are definitely not allowed to show a couple touching in any way. This is why so many Iranian filmmakers choose to make movies about children or life on the streets, because they simply don't want to get near those issues that could cause their films to be confiscated. For example, Majid Majidi's film, Children of Heaven, is one of the most popular Iranian films of all time. It follows the moving story of a poor brother and sister who have to share a single pair of shoes. Another acceptable topic is the Iranian Revolution of 1979. This revolution has defined much of the Iranian film industry over the last 30 years. In fact, the end of the revolution marked the start of the strict censorship in Iranian film. However, despite this censorship, some films are beginning to get international recognition. History was made this winter when Oscar Vahadi's film, A Separation, won Best Foreign Film and was nominated for Best Screenplay at the Academy Awards. The movie is a raw, intense family drama. After 14 years of marriage, Nadir and Simon are getting a divorce. The movie delves deeply into the lives of everyday Iranians. It contrasts the perspectives of those who are deeply religious and those who are perhaps a little bit more casual in their beliefs. The movie stars Leila Hatami, who is currently one of the most popular Iranian actresses. Her characters are always multi-layered and given plenty of opportunities to develop. Increasingly, female directors have also been growing in popularity. Rakashad Benny Mithyad is a director and a screenwriter. She's directed many films throughout the last few decades and has won multiple awards. One of her most famous films is Nargis, a film about a love triangle and a gang of thieves. Therefore, in many ways, the Iranian film industry is far more advanced in their acceptance and portrayal of women than many other film industries from around the world. There are many ways in which Iranian film is very progressive. Interestingly enough, a professor, Dr. Hamid Dabashi, believes that it is a censorship which has caused all this creativity. He believes that all the restrictions have forced the filmmakers to think in new ways. However, documentary filmmaker Maziar Bahari disagrees. He says romanticizing censorship is a great disservice to Iranian artists. Some people have begun to fight the tight restrictions. Director Jafar Panahi has recently made a film while under house arrest in Tehran. Filmed with an iPhone, his movie is all about the censorship in Iran. Sure to be confiscated by the Iranian officials, it was smuggled out of the country inside a cake and is now generating quite a lot of attention. It is called This Is Not A Film. However, despite the censorship, the Iranian film industry is expanding and gaining increasing amounts of recognition for its brilliance and creativity. A separation could just be a foretaste of many other Iranian films soon to be distributed around the world. If you want to gain an insightful perspective on Iran, rent a DVD, log on to Netflix, or go to YouTube and begin to explore.